So I'm in Cliduck today, which is a local one. Some of you may remember it from my video at Cliduck Gorge. As you can see, I'm with Jordan. He hasn't been on the channel in God knows how long. He asked me to come along today before work. Apparently we're going to see some abandoned, burnt out, stolen cars, Land Rovers, Fords, etc, etc. So I thought, why not? A bit of abandoned, a bit of hiking, a bit of traveling, all in one video, realistically. I have got my camera with me, but I got a 50 mil on, so I'm gonna film with my phone. So without further ado, let's get into this video. After a little bit of a walk, we're here. So as you can see, like I said, they're stolen, dumped, obviously fire damaged cars. You'll have to forgive me on knowledge, because I am useless. But the only one I do know possibly, that is a Land Rover. We will get closer because I've put my wide angle lens on. Thankfully I fell over on my camera and my new lens which is on you is safe and sound. I'm just trying to navigate down this rocky hill and see some cars. I always like wonder when you see places like this, how the cars actually got up there. But obviously this is an old quarry, so I'm assuming there would have been a road at some point. But as you can see, it's just, it looks like a chassis of a trailer, but eh? This is the landy that I know. It's not really hard to tell that that's a landy, is it? Really? Let me just put that down. Look at that though, look. Look at the wheels. Obviously, they are flat, but they would have looked like, sorry, let me fork to, a brand new tire at some point. Shame. That looks like a Ford. Sierra possibly to me. It seems like maybe a Sierra. Can you let me know down below? It sure shows you that Land Rovers were built to uh, to last. I mean, something of that then, because obviously the key has been The key has been broken in there, or that's how they broke into it, possibly. Sorry, I am trying to focus it for you. As you can see. Very cool to see, though. I can't even tell you what that is. Is that an old lorry? That possibly looks like an old lorry up there as well. Wow. There's two vehicles on one there though by the looks of it. Yeah, so I got that wrong. That's actually a transit. It just took me a while to notice, but yeah, definitely an old transit where it belongs, if you ask me. And then we have an old metro. And whatever this is underneath. Camber, yo. Just like on the Beetle. It's riding Camber. God knows what this is. It's going to be a lot of that. Maybe a Nova or Focus. 
It's really hard to tell. Like I said, if you know any, just let me know in the description or comments below. So I know Jordan said that's a beamer down there, what he's talking about. Sorry, I'm just trying to concentrate walking and filming. Very interesting, but yeah, we have like an old train station or something. That, that was the old building, and then you've got the old platform and tracks. But the wooden tracks, well, there's one wooden and one metal. Nice little find. Well, that was a nice little um, explore. I didn't expect to do it today because i got to get home and get ready for work now. But shout out to Jordan for inviting me. His uh, channel will be in the description. If you are new to this channel, please consider su subscribing for abandoned related content every now and again. Van life stuff, travels, unique places, and basically just a part of my life. Um, I'm absolutely boiling because it is very muggy today. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching the video. If you could like, comment and smash the subscribe button if you're new. I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.